Yo, what is going on everybody? Guiding Light here back with another video. And in this one, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can transfer your PlayStation or Xbox Destiny account over to PC. So Bungie finally put this feature out today. So for anyone that's owned a PC and has been waiting to transfer their account just like me, we can finally get started on doing that. So in this video, I'll show you guys step by step everything that you need to do in order to get started on this. So the first thing you need to do is just head over to the Bungie website and log into your Bungie account. Now you will need a battle.net account and you will also need a Steam account in order to get started on this as well. After this, just click on settings and you'll see a bunch of different options pop up here. So at the top of your screen, it's going to say to enable cross save now. But if you look, there will also be a tab for accounts and linking. And what you want to do is actually click on this link first because Destiny 2 is actually switching over from Battle.net to Steam. So in order to do this, you will need a Steam account. If you have not created a Steam account yet, I would do that right now. If you have a Steam account already, what you need to do is just click on the link button and you need to link your Steam account here to your Bungie account. And once you've done that, you can go about doing the cross save. So once you've gone through linking your Steam, scroll up to the top of the page and you will see that you can start to activate cross save. You wanna click activate now and you're gonna go through a bunch of different steps. The first step, you will have to acknowledge the statement that says that cross-platform is an as-is basis and they can actually remove it at any time. There's another statement that says that any platform provider may decide to remove the cross-save function as well. And that you can also disable cross-save and re-enable it, but you will have to wait about 90 days. So after you agree to this, you will be brought to a different page here. And this is where you're going to sign into your respected platforms that you want to transfer over. So. If you would like to transfer your PlayStation account, you just need to sign in to the PlayStation window, Xbox window, whichever one you'd like. You'll also need to sign into the Steam account that you want to sign in with, and you also need to sign in with the Battle.net that you'd like to sign in with. So just sign into your either your Xbox account or your PlayStation account, then double check and make sure that your characters are actually correct and that it is the right username up on top. And then what you would need to do from there is actually log into a Steam account. So with everyone trying to do this right now, there has been a few problems with it, but just keep on trying and eventually it should pop up and you'll just need to sign in and click another agree option. And this is pretty much the last step. After this, you just need to select the characters that you want to be activated for cross save. So I'm going to click my PlayStation 4 account here as that's the main one that I'm going to be hopping around on. And after that, you want to click on review setup. The next stage is going to show you guys what clan you're going to transfer over to once you're on PC. It will also show you which DLCs and things you've purchased and you can see your clan there in the bottom left corner. So once you've double checked and made sure everything is correct here, you just need to click yes at the bottom window and you will be able to link your account. So that's pretty much it for me in this video guys. Hopefully it does help you guys out to finally get the account linking set up. So that's pretty much it here for me in this video. Those are all of the steps that you guys are going to need in order to finally transfer from PlayStation over to PC. So it's pretty nice to see that Bungie was finally able to bring this feature out. I'm pretty excited to start grinding on PC and I've been putting off even getting some of the gear just because I know it's going to be a lot more fun to get it on PC. So I'll still be playing Destiny on PC. I'm definitely going to ha be having a lot of fun testing out some of the weapons that I have on this character on my PC account. Because normally when I play on PC, I have to play on a totally different account with a different username. And so that account has its own weapons and stuff like that. I also don't have a Titan or a Warlock on that account. So it'll be nice to finally use a Warlock and a Titan in the Crucible on PC for the very first time. So I was thinking about making some more content on this game. My first experience on a Titan, first experience on a Warlock for PC. And also maybe even give you guys some good setups and stuff like that. Because the meta is a lot different on PC because of how the guns perform. If you guys want to see any more future Destiny content on the channel about how to do better on PC after switching to console, be sure to let me know down in the comments, and I will catch you guys in the next Destiny video. Peace.